it's not so much, you know, when it happened, it was obviously very scary. But right at that moment, you're just kind of following along and trying to figure out what was happening and, and you know, what can we do, if anything. Um, but it was in the f few weeks after it happened that were the most terrifying. Um, because we lived so close to New York and, and with everything that happened, all the newspapers published things to get ready. You know, you need to get plastic to keep to cover your windows if there was going to be another attack. Um, get money, because all the ATMs were closed for a long time. Um, get money in the house in case you need to, you know, have it. You always have your car filled up, which I still remember to today, you know. Um, I never run it low because if there's an emergency, you're out of luck. And, you know, the gas stations were crowded as any anything for weeks after that everybody was you know filling up gas cans and and whatever um, you know make sure you have money make sure you have medication and it was all this preparation for what we didn't know what was going to happen and it and it was very very scary